This is the Voice of Early Childhood podcast. Hello, everyone. So this episode is all about our latest big announcement, which is our inaugural conference. I'm so thrilled to announce that the Voice of Early Childhood conference is taking place on Saturday the 8th of July 2023 at Nottingham Trent University. So the conference is all about bringing the sector together and encouraging us all to be active agents of change with one of our main conference themes being pursuing active change in the sector. And it's important for me to highlight here that the conference is taking place in the center of England, which is relatively unusual for a large early childhood event, but that is the whole point. So I've heard too many times from the sector that so many early childhood events and conferences take place in London and understandably so. However, in true the voice of early childhood style, we are changing things up and ensuring that such events are more accessible to a wider range of people from across the country, from across the UK. Um, so we are already seeing a change with more events popping up outside of London, um, and we're continuing this drive for change um, in the name of wider accessibility. And for our educators from Scotland, for instance, the Midlands is far closer than London. So we listened to the sector expressing that a lot of early childhood events are too often London centric and we're mixing things up. Now I'm going to return to our overarching themes of the conference. The first theme which I mentioned is pursuing active change in the sector. And the other two key themes are repositioning the voice of children in our early childhood services and supporting children and their families from before birth to school ready. Now I won't give too much away um, here otherwise I'll start presenting an entire seminar. Um, so the aim of this conference is to not only provide an opportunity for high quality continuous professional development but importantly, to provide a safe space for inquisitive dialogue and shared reflection. And those of you that know me know that this is very, very important to me. And I'll kind of go on to say a little bit more in a minute. Um, but what the conference will feature is a keynote speech, a number of seminars, quite a few seminars actually, um, and a whole conference discussion. Um, and I always advocate for educators to be critical consumers of any content, whether they are reading something or hearing something. I think we should all be critical consumers of anything that we take in, especially in today's day and age where we have content coming from all ang angles at us, you know, everywhere. Um, and lots of kind of different mixed views, um, mixed opinions, expertise, different levels of expertise and knowledge. Um, and coming from a wide range of people from different kind of sectors, I guess. So at the conference, there will certainly be space for a healthy dose of debate. So I would encourage you to come prepared to not only to learn, but most importantly, to reflect, ask questions, discuss and debate. To find out more and to buy your tickets, visit the website, thevoiceofearlychildhood.com. All of the information you need can be accessed on the website and via the ticket link, including the full programme, the seminar topics, speaker details, what's included in the price, exhibitor and sponsor details, and the running of the whole day. So this is a really kind of short and sweet um, episode to announce the conference, but I will be putting out more information via um, like the podcast and all of our social media channels and the website in terms of articles and snippets around the conference um, as we kind of lead up to it and to get you um, to build kind of your excitement around it 
um, and to start looking forward to this fantastic event where we're bringing lots of people together, all in the name of sharing the voices of those who work with children and sharing the voices of children and families themselves. So I look forward to seeing you at the Voice of Early Childhood Conference on the 8th of July.